Well, I guess so. 51 mil, not bad. On the crappy FX3 version, yeah. Okay, you guys got a title screen? Okay. So it looks like we're good to go. Um, let me check my uh, Twitch end poll first. Okay. Okay, for... Um, Oh shoot, I forgot to I forgot to upload a upload a video for this. I beat the high score yesterday. I was too busy with other stuff to work on a work on trying to get that uploaded. But for those that have never seen me stream this game, I typically play random tables. And unless I have a good reason for doing so, I don't play the same one twice. I have over a hundred tables on here, so it's not really worth my while to keep playing the same one over and over and over. So, and I gotta do one more check. Okay, my mic works. You've just crossed over uh, into the Twilight Zone. Bad way to start. You unlock this door with the key of imagination. See, this is this is the plunger I was talking about when I was playing FX3. You hold down space bar, but if you if you look at how it moves. It's like really slow and gradual. It doesn't. Yoink. Perfect. Um, I don't really like the table enough to warrant uh, having it on two players. Doing that, it just doubles the torture. Like I said, I'm not that big a fan of this table. I did it. Did like a did like a a light light tap pass on a flipper and went over into the other one. Not sure which one this is. Jack's open. This is actually one of my favorite tables right here. For one, if you if you look down here, totally unique outlines. This makes uh catching the ball actually a dangerous pop proposition, because they'll just go down, roll, and right down. Um, oh, what was I gonna say? Same for just letting the ball hit bounce off the flipper. Sometimes it'll boing bounce backwards into the hole. So you. Basically, for the most part, you have to be very careful about catching the ball. Like, you don't just hold the flipper up and let the ball bounce. You have to kind of, you have to kind of tap hit the ball and kind of slow down a bit. But as for the table itself, if you can see here at the center, these are the shots you have to make. I have to make two jacks, then three queens. Basically, it's not about just taking down all the drop targets. It's about taking down only certain ones. So. Totally unique here.
Okay, three queens are next. Nope, missed it. So I'm hit, basically hitting everything but the queens. Get all the rollovers up on top, it spots a hand. So there's going to be times where I actually avoid hitting that last one. Too early. Like that, see? Of course I have it right there. Okay, now to get the royal flush. I'm hitting everything but what everything but what I need. Believe it or not, getting all those hands, after getting all those, it actually becomes easier now because the only targets that are going to be standing are the ones that you have to make. But uh, from here on out, take down all the targets and gives you a special. with the ball bounce and messed it up. Okay, next one. An unbelievable smash. An unbelievable smash. Okay, one of the rare exceptions. This table I actually don't mind so much. Okay, uh, note to... Yeah. Alright, note to self. Don't go for the skill shot. Center field. Center field. Gage crashes the scoreboard. 
Ah, I know what you meant. modes ever right here. You have to actually aim for the club. What a play, my friend! What a play, my friend, Thomas! Easy, easy, easy. Single file down the middle. Frank Thomas? Uh, no. Shoot the scoop. From, from what I understand of him, he's slow as hell. He's the last guy I'd want stealing home. He breaks for second. Hey! Can he do it again? Another break for third? Watch for that. Twitch app refreshed. Again. 
much for that. Okay, looks like I'm being raided. But yeah, normally I don't play two player on this one. This is one of the not so fun tables. The only reason I did that is just because the ball drain. Just like that. I mean, I like to play this one for at least a little while. Yeah. Okay, uh, for, the, for those shits getting in, um, the way I do this is usually I play random tables. And unless I have a good reason for doing so, I don't play the same one twice. I've got over a hundred of these things, so really not much point in playing the same one over and over. Dark Knight, I died. Well, Doctor Who is definitely the better of the two. Um, I'm going to go ahead and say, just to be safe, I'm going to go ahead and set this one to two player as well. There's a certain order you have to do things on this one. Playfield X is what you're wanting. Um, you basically shoot it up here. You try to get this loop as many times as you can until you get 4x playfield. And then that, I believe you're trying to go for multi-ball after that. I haven't played this one in a long time, so I'm kind of details are kind of hazy. Otherwise, the, the go-to is just get this shot, then get that shot, then get that shot. You keep spelling who, eventually, we'll get an extra ball. I'm actually trying to avoid multi-ball. Unlocking multi ball, just just like pin by, keep hitting that center chest up there. Steal other players' multi balls on this one. Yeah, a little late on that. Ball. 
Seems I've lost that shot over there. There we go. Video mode, there's a certain order you have to do them in. It doesn't change at all. Unfortunately, I don't remember what they were. Like I said, I don't I don't remember what the order was. And unfortunately, I don't remember where you got the extra ball. There it is. Remember, I'm still trying to get that play field value up, to, up too, so when the ball is on training, of course. Three of these for a multi ball, I believe the last one you get is what your um, multi ball scoring is going to be based on. But that basically means you want to take, get the two end ones first, and then the middle one last. ball save. on this one. Hell, it didn't even give me a chance.
Oh, misunderstood that. I thought I was supposed to take all three of them down. But like I said, this has been a while since I played this. Uh, dirty pool. I was gonna try to nudge, nudge the table while it was bouncing up like that. I was gonna try to nudge it over into the right flipper, but it didn't go over far enough. Should have trained. Oh, God, did I get lucky? Uh, 
multi ball's over. I shouldn't still be talking. Okay, there we go. Playfield's at the max right now. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I'll... When I get a chance, I will. Yeah, it's 516, so I've definitely done better. score. As before, just like Pimba, you keep hitting that chest a bunch of times. Oh, this is wave two. That's why. Got all doctors. Okay, that's my top score. Well, almost beat it. Oh, 
said there's only three. Oh, guessed wrong. the one in the middle. Damn it. Got a little greedy. And yes, I will be eating cinnamon rolls throughout the stream, too. Okay, next table. Yes! It's one of my faves right here. Yeah. <laughs> that very rarely happens on my watch. Uh, basically, the objective of this table, hit this a bunch of times till this fills up. Hit this a bunch of times till that fills up. Hit that a bunch of times till that fills up. After that, get up this ramp. Then get in this hole. And then I'll start multi-ball. It'll it increase this by a level. You do this like probably about five times and it lights gazillions. It's basically the wizard mode of this table. Kill the music. Okay, now I gotta get the ramp. short table. Oh. 
That's right. Still gotta find that shot. There it is. And then darn multi-ball, keep getting in the ramp. And there is kind of a consolation prize at this point. When you lose multi-ball, until the end of the ball, all your scores are doubled. Hey baby, can I buy you a Flex is one, two, and three. It's just a series of hurry ups. So gotta get up that ramp. One drawback to this table is uh, the in-game music and the in-game voice voices. It gets annoying because it'll repeat over and over. Oh, it counted. Just gotta get in that left hole when it doesn't drain like that. Fun while it lasted. Ride the hurricane! The far superior version to the one on FX3 by leaps and bounds. Hurry, hurry, hurry! Step right this way! If you spell palace, it lights the jackpot up in that center lane there. And it bounces out anyway.
to be sitting here all day. My grandma throws better than Millions light. I could be sitting here all day. Oh, no. Ride the world's tallest Ferris wheel. See the clown perform his amazing trick. Gotta get that right ramp. And I guarantee you an extra ball. Look, ma, no ball set. Jackpot, gotta get up the middle. You know, I had no problems at all going up the middle earlier, but then again, nothing was lit over there, so. Oh, bad call. Shouldn't have nudged it. Blew that one. Hi, Paradise. Now multi ball. One million. Well, so much for that. I think I saw that. I thought it went up on the Ferris wheel all the way. Million. What? What kind of 
Jackpot up the middle. Second chance. There we go. Balls like <laughs> that was uh, actually totally on accident, too. Just happened to be in the right place at the right time. Yes, the high score is mine. Yeah, that's what I was wondering too. Game bug. Cotton candy. Oh. And that is one drawback to this table. Taxi has the same issue as well. Um, usually. When the ball comes out of the ramps, it usually comes out at a normal Not rate of speed. Candy. Once in a while, though, pew, the ball just flies out of there. Oftentimes, I don't notice it until it's right past me. What kind 
need to throw it back. Come on, ugly. Yeah, I see what you're talking about. I could be sitting here all day. One while it lasted. <clears throat> okay, off to the next one. I am the Black Knight. Oh, Freya, your favorite table's on. And this one here, I'll go ahead and set the two players as well. I am the Basically, you want to keep it off. You want to keep the ball in the upper play field as much as you can. The um drawbridge the drawbridge is raised. Give me a moment. There's one. Two more to go. But uh what I was trying to say is advanced ransom. When you like the rollovers. You have like 15, 20 seconds to do it if you can get the ball up in here and get a ransom weapon. If you can completely spell ransom, everything is unlocked. It's basically an all hell of Eve. No um, I'm not sure, Katarl. Like I said, I don't, I very seldom if ever get raided. I sure as hell have never been raided with 103 people before, though. That's a first. Usually for the rare time I get rained, it's like five or six people. Hey, Bubba, we just like man down, so we thought we'd just check you out. You know, that's about it. I 
not this time. Still. Get up in that upper ramp for jackpot. Good. On that upper ramp now. I only have so much time. Bit of a bad call there. But like I was trying to say, once you light all these up, you have 15, 20 seconds to get the ball up in here, then you get a ransom. multi ball Stand up and fight. Jack 
pot. Oh, I'm gonna get to hear some cool victory lap music. Provided I, I can keep the ball in play long enough. You are champion. After the multi ball, though, it's gonna be a lot harder. Once but twice. I wasn't supposed to do that. Ah, double nice challenge. Uh, basically, what the scoreboard says, gotta make the war target targets up in the upper, upper play field. Three times now. I think that little baby bumper's in a bad spot right there. And yes, believe it or not, the high score is mine. That was an ex extreme fluke right there. Because uh, from here on, after now, after your first multi ball, for each lock, you have to. Uh, you have to hit all three of these targets. So it's going to be a lot harder to get the uh, King's Ransom down. Yeah, no, very upsetting.
Talking and start chalking. Chalk up. Really? I'd like to play this one for at least a little while. Chalk up. Beans is a pretty nostalgic table for me, you know. Used to play this one back when I was a little kid. Go for C. Six ball. Five ball. Two ball. Not too soon on that. Seven ball. Now, now the eight ball. Sink the eighth ball. Sink the eighth ball. Corner pocket. Get the bank shot. Nice shot. Get the deluxe. Get the C. Oh. Nice bank shot. Go for C. Go for I have to get control of the ball. One more for the lot. Rack him up. Five ball. Get the C. Nice bank shot. Seven ball. One ball. Go for C. Nice shot. Nice bank shot. Okay. Nice shot. Go for C. 
Um, what are you saying about going for C? If you can hit the like the two uh two rollovers on top and the two inlines, it spots a ball. That's all. A whole ton of trouble just for that. shot to make now. It's actually a hell of a lot harder when the drop targets are here because usually when they hit a drop target it just goes straight right down the middle. And I'm thinking I probably beat my high score. So I don't recall me ever lasting this long on here. Make the achievement. I've been playing right now, I'd hope so. Because, uh, this is probably the one and only time I've ever lasted this long on this table. Usually it lasts maybe a minute or two. One more for Deluxe. gonna let the ball drain. You've got the stripes. There's no need for the second player now. Thanks, Katara. Seven balls. 
Ball for Joe. See, this is how it normally goes on this table. Let's hope I don't screw up the initials now. Yes! I dominated the highest score. And uh, most certainly, if I can remember to, I'll go ahead and upload this to YouTube. Yeah. Today's my lucky day, apparently. Go for the hill. Oh, bonsai run. This is probably not going to be a table I'll last very long. At all. Of course, I said the same thing about 8 Ball Deluxe, but look what I got. Welcome, race fans, to Bonsai Run. Oh, 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 oh. No, 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 not yet. Welcome, race fans, to Bonsai Run. Basically, just hitting all the flashing lights, it's got to light up. It's got to light various targets up on the upper play field. If I can even get up there. Is he 
you can see that orange arrow up there in the upper left, that's what I'm trying to aim for. Got it. And now from the upper play field. Put a move on green machine and blue beard. One red flashing target up there. He's going after Red Hot. Go for the hill. And uh, I would think I'd be able to get up there with the upright flipper. I would think so. wanted to and um the left kickback is actually fairly easy to relight if you can see that little hole way at the back of the table just gotta get that you don't have to do any pinball hokey pokey or anything like that in order to relight it put a move on green machine and yellow belly There's a skill shot back there, by the way. Got it. Jeez. Hope you're not prone to se hope no one's prone to seizures. Back. 
Game bug. I guess she got the music. There it goes. I'll screw that up. If I hold the back again. <clears throat> I don't recall me ever lasting this long out here. Usually it's just a quick three and out. There's a skill shot at the very back of that table. If you can see the uh, orange arrows up there, that's what I'm getting for. Hey, I just noticed something. Kind of a cool little feature. If you could, um, if you could challenge people, quick, like, quickly, consecutively, like, um, these challenge green machine. If you could challenge somebody else immediately after, they'll say, and red hot. Like, the, they'll add on the word and. Pretty nice, pretty neat little quirk. I want to say revolutionary as well, but... Take it that whatever you will. Duh. Duh, 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 duh. 
almost Aaron player too. Not once, but twice. I should have notched it the other way. And the back of my neck. And my upper back is starting to hurt. Ow! me that got it. back. This 
still need to get that kick back a little bit. I know I can do it. Looks like I can get up there with the right flipper too. Too early. Should have nudged. <clears throat> well, I just barely beat the uh, console version. Guitar. Showing that uh, everything is in working order over here, like no drop frames or anything. But uh, this table here, it's all about the left ramp. Ramp, ramp, and when in doubt, ramp again. Not sure.
Watch me suck. <laughs> Machine complete and fully operational. And as before, in front of the left ramp. Oh, that went to hell. I'm losing it. But um, during that multi ball, because uh, try to let me try to gain control of the ball real quick. But during multi ball. My only real option at, right after the balls come out is uh, I gotta be able to get a ball up here on the ramp. That'll buy me a little bit of time. Otherwise, I can't really trap the balls because all the one of them always almost always drains. So uh, if I can't get a ball up the ramp immediately, it's not gonna happen. some time but again during multi-ball you're trying to get back up the ramp get up there Set at the start of the table, it's all about the left ramp, because guess where I get guess where I have to go now? That's right, you guessed it. The left ramp. Hi there. My god, she's alive. Just like that, she is gone. I'm turning back. I'm turning back. How's it working now? I can't okay. Okay, yeah, I did have a problem with Twitch too. My uh, app crashed once earlier today. <laughs> God, it looks so freaking hilarious. I wonder, I wonder if this is like a censorship thing right here. Having those big silver things around your mouth. Make her look less hoary. Sucked. 
Looking up, looking up. Oh, there we go. It just dropped frames, so. But yeah, I've never dropped this many before. See, so yeah, I'm thinking it's probably a Twitch. There it goes. Alright, um, fairly recent issue, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm seeing it now, my, in, my, uh, stream is going in and out, so, yeah, it's cutting out, let me, let me do this. Clear that out. Uh, not from my end. Yeah, my internet is all kinds of fucking up right now. Okay, major technical difficulties right now. Uh, yeah, it's, it's going in and out right now. So I'm just going to go ahead and... I'm just going to go ahead and kill it. Uh, I'd probably have to shut down about a half hour, 45 minutes anyway. So I don't want to spend the rest of that time with it, with it blacking in and out. But yeah, uh, but otherwise, pretty good session. Um, FX3 kind of sucked, but uh, Pinball Arcade actually went pretty well. I think I beat a high score or two, so, yeah, and if I remember to, and if I have time, I still got morning shit I gotta take care of, so, if I got time, I'll try to get, I'll try to get those videos uploaded to YouTube, but, uh, otherwise, hey, thanks a lot for dropping in and hanging out with me, everybody, I appreciate that, and, um, and I should be on to stream some pinball or whatever else, but, it'll be, uh, probably next week, but, uh, otherwise, I will be on later on tonight, between 4 to 6 p.m. U.S. Central Time. And I'll be streaming on Final Fantasy XIV. Assuming my internet isn't crapping out on me or anything. So, but until then. Bye now, everybody. See you all next time.